गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स होप यू ऑल हैव डन योर यूटीज वेल एंड इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव कंप्लीटेड चैप्टर फोर सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू क्वेश्चन आंसर्स एंड बैक एक्सरसाइज ऑफ चैप्टर फोर प्लांट्स अराउंड अस आई होप यू ऑल हैव बुक्स विद यू सो ओपन पेज नंबर ट्वेंटी नाइन इन बुक our first question is fill in the blanks first plants growing on hills are tall straight and have conical shape so you have to write answer conical in the blank now name two trees that grow on plains you can write any uh, two trees like mango banyan people as you wish number 3 breathing roots are also called aerial roots breathing roots we can say these roots also aerial roots so write aerial roots name an underwater plant that is hydrilla and last one lotus stem is eaten as a vegetable so now come on the next part match the following evergreen trees you can uh, match with Uh, you can match with rubber and teak e with one needle like leaves pine and cedar that is f part then no leaves cactus breathing roots mangrove air filled cavities aquatic plant and a cultivated crop rice so numbering will be 6 3 4 5 1 2 now c part tick the correct options for this i have highlighted the answers first one is it is a free floating plant that is water hyacinth number 2 these are unwanted plants answer is weeds because weeds are unwanted plants that they are, they have no use it can survive in soil with very little water that is cactus because cactus is a desert plant that needs very less water to grow now you have to open your notebook and write chapter's name plant around us date cw then part d question answers question number 1 you have to write question with black point black pen and write answers with blue gel pen so first question is what are terrestrial plants so write answer plants that grow on land are called terrestrial plants for example neem mango then leave one line blank after that you have to write question number 2 how does the conical shape help the plants of hills answer the conical shape of plants does not allow snow to get deposited on them then question number 3 name two trees growing in hot and wet regions answer is coconut and rubber question number 4 name an underwater plant what kind of leaves does it have hydrilla is an underwater plant it has pointed and strap like leaves you can write hydrilla and tape grass also but in your book that is hydrilla so write it now question number 5 that is last question of part d what is plowing plowing the process of loosening and tilling the soil is called plowing write your question answers with neat handwriting thank you students do your work very neat and clean